In this question, we are asked to match the lettered structures in the plastinated coronal section of the thorax with the numbered structures in the plastic models. Each numbered structure may be used once or not at all. So let's look at the first lettered structure, A. A is the esophagus. This is at the superior mediastinum here. The esophagus is the most posterior structure and then the trachea is just in the front of it. So the esophagus here matches the esophagus number four in the plastic model. See, in the plastic model, this is the anterior aspect, and this is the posterior aspect, and we can see that the most posterior structure here is the esophagus. In front of the esophagus is the trachea. In front of the trachea, lower down, is the branches of the pulmonary trunk, and then in front of that, it is the aorta and its branches. In front of that, it is the veins, the superior vena cava and the brachiocephalic veins. B, it's the trachea, and B matches with 6. C represents a structure that is arching from anterior to posterior, and this is the arch of the aorta. You can see here that the arch of the aorta is so closely related to the esophagus to the trachea. In fact, the arch of the aorta can push the trachea a little bit to the right and it might indent itself on the esophagus. Aneurysm of the arch of the aorta might cause compression of the trachea and esophagus. So uh, C is the arch of the aorta and C matches with 7. Again, this is the arch of the aorta. D is another arch above the root of the right lung. The C is, uh, the arch of the aorta is an arch on the left side above the root of the left lung, and D is an arch above the root of the right lung. And so this is the arch of the azygous vein. The arch of the azygous vein arches from behind forwards over the root of the right lung and drains into the superior vena cava. Superior vena cava should be somewhere here and receives the arch of the uh, azygous vein. So this is the superior vena cava here. This is the right side of the heart, right atrium, receiving the superior vena cava, and the superior vena cava receives the azygous arch from behind. Therefore, D matches with 12. E, this is a pulmonary artery, right pulmonary artery. So here is the left pulmonary artery. This is the right pulmonary artery. Pulmonary arteries are branches of the pulmonary trunk. And here is the region of the pulmonary trunk. And 8, in this case, is the right pulmonary artery because we are looking at the heart from the right side. This is the right pulmonary artery. In the plastic model, it is represented as blue because although it's an artery in structure, but it contains venous blood that reach the lung to be uh, oxygenated and return back through the pulmonary veins. So although these are in structure, number nine is a right pulmonary vein. Structurally, it's a vein, but it contains arterial blood and it drains into the left atrium. So E, the right pulmonary artery matches with eight. F, this is the most posterior chamber of the heart and it is the left atrium. Being most posterior to the heart, then it will be also related to the esophagus. Left atrium matches with 10. And the left atrium here in the plastic model, as we have just mentioned, is receiving the pulmonary veins, two pulmonary veins on either side. And you can see here the relation between the left atrium and the esophagus. G is a thick muscular part of the heart and it is located on the posterior aspect of the heart on the left side so it is the left ventricle you can see here that the left ventricle forms only a small portion of the anterior surface of the heart h is the inferior vena cava as you can see here it passes through the central tendon of the diaphragm comes from the abdomen passes through the central tendon of the diaphragm and opens into the left atrium. So this is the inferior vena cava here. And this is again, this is the site of the inferior vena cava. This site of the opening of the inferior vena cava matches with the level of T8 vertebra. 
passes through the central tendon of the diaphragm at the level of T8 vertebra.